Betty Boop's lifeguard definitely got off to a good start, but I didn't really care for the direction this one took. This is, of course, a Fleischer Studios Betty Boop cartoon from 1934. This one's directed by Dave Fleischer and Will Adbowski, and Bonnie Poe voices Betty Boop in this one. And it starts off with a really great beach scene, and Betty Boop meets the lifeguard, a character called Freddy. And... Betty Boop is out swimming on a little rubber horse and it's really, really well animated and I really liked it. And then she gets into a bit of bother and Freddy has to come and rescue her. And then Betty Boop ends up underwater and she becomes a mermaid. And to start off with, I thought, this is this is interesting. It's not what I expected. But then it just took a direction I didn't care for and the things she interacted with under the water I didn't think was... I didn't think it was a very interesting narrative after that point. And I can't complain about the animation. The animation is beautiful. Even underwater, it is gorgeous. We have very strong images in the foreground, very soft backgrounds. Visually, it's absolutely fine, but the narrative just became really dull to me. And I also feel like we could have spent more time on the beach because what we saw was really well animated as well. And I really liked the design of the beach and, you know, the parasols and various other things. So it didn't take a direction that I loved. But it started off really well, and the animation quality is really good, and the music in it is very nice as well. So there are a lot of positives about this, but for me, it's not a perfect cartoon. It just took a direction that I personally didn't really care for. Would I recommend it? Absolutely, if you're a Betty Boop fan. There are a lot of strong things in this, but as a whole, I didn't love it. So it's certainly not my favourite Betty Boop cartoon. But it's not terrible. And it might appeal to other people more than it does to me. So I don't love the decision in a certain direction. I obviously don't want to spoil too much about what happens in case you decide to watch it. But I think it could appeal to some people. So Betty Boop's Lifeguard is not a personal favourite. It's, it's offering a lot of good things. But the narrative for me isn't perfect. I'd recommend it if you're a fan of Betty Boop cartoons. But I wouldn't recommend it as the first one to watch. There are others, annoyingly, non spring to mind, but there are others that I think are much better. But that being said, it's an okay cartoon.